Hello, hello, this is Kara, and I have a quick little video to show you this year's new Christmas kit. I called it Vintage Santa. <laughs> Not the most creative name, but uh, it kind of gave what it is. So I felt like, you know how you do your December daily and have your memory keeping? I felt like this was kind of a, a vintage, vintage take on that. So maybe someone who had collected vintage ephemera and they post like taped it or stapled it into a journal and then I thought that would be fun if you then take it and do a December daily with it it would just have some vintage images and everyone loves a vintage Santa right <laughs> okay so I think there's six uh journal pages and the journal pages are the ones that I decorate more and then I have background pages um, and those are the ones that you can print on the back. Of course, you can do whatever you like. You can cut these apart and use them as ephemera. It's really up to you. But I thought this, these vintage belt buckles were perfect with the vintage Santa. And then we have some thread and um, a little safety pin, you know, for fixing the Santa suit. <laughs> All right, so let's take a look. Oh, and there's a little washi tape and staples. So here we have some more vintage Santa, and you'll see some of this um, vintage kind of, what is it called? It's like etchings, but anyway, and some deer, and then we have some Christmas trees. This here, another one with a paper clip together, and some more Santas. And then we have a little cluster here and so another Santa. I just love this guy. So cool. And then we have some backgrounds. Again, you can make tags out of these, print them on the backs. Of course, they needed some collage pages. There's one with Christmas music. I'm working on a Christmas music, um, just digital, just pages of the... Christmas music, so keep your eye out for that. It's almost ready. And then we have this background in red. And then we have this book page of, I think it's the night before Christmas, a page from it. And then I have some itty bitty belt buckles. I don't know if you can see. Just thought that was fun, a little pattern. And then this is kind of, because you'll see the same style of this book. So that one's um, a blank one that you can use really in any journal. And then I needed some more Christmas trees. Here's another collage. It would be great for an envelope. Tags, cut apart. Then I needed some fussy cuts. And I just loved that um, thread. So I did that. And then I did Santa's belt. This would be a great belly band or something on the cover of a journal. And then we have our tags. And our envelopes. Not our envelopes. These are pockets. <laughs> And some fussy cut Santas. And then more ephemera. And then we have these are envelopes, <laughs> coin envelopes. And I wanted to show you that this kit coordinates with a kit that I made last year. And it's called Vintage Santa, Vintage Santa Ephemera. So here it's five pages and it's full of ephemera. So if you needed more ephemera than what's in the digital junk journal kit, you have this one, a lot of cut aparts. There's that guy again. I just love that guy. And then we have some fussy cut Santas. And then we have this one. So this is also in the shop. If you have the August newsletter, the one where I shared the Halloween kits, there's an August coupon code, which is more of a discount than the Labor Day sale that I have going on. So um, if you don't have the newsletter, you can sign up. I think I've set it up correctly so that if you sign up, you'll get the next email with the coupon code. If not, let me know. Um, it's kind of a funky thing to set up. But if you aren't wanting the newsletter, you can go in and there's 25% off with the Labor Day sale. All right, um, I think that's all. Keep your eye out for the music pages. Um, oh, one other thing, if you're still with me. <laughs> um, 
I have loved having a guest design team for the Halloween kits and I'm probably going to do the same thing for Christmas. So you can either email me, message me, um, let me know if that is something that you would be interested in being part of. Um, and as always, I hope you have a wonderfully crafty day. Bye-bye.